Hi, my name is Paul and I'm a Marie Curie Early Stage Researcher in PhD student here at the School of Sport, Exercise and Rehabilitation Science at the University of Birmingham. Prior to commencing my PhD, I obtained a BSc Honours in Sports Science and Health from Dublin City University in the Republic of Ireland, where I graduated in November of 2015 with a first class honours. My core research interests pertain to the areas of clinical exercise physiology, and physical activity psychology and disease and illness prevention and rehabilitation. I'm also immensely interested in interdisciplinary research and I'm fortunate enough to have both Professor Anna Whitker and Professor John Lord as my supervisory team here at the University of Birmingham. The thing my PhD relates to assessing the impact of physical activity and healthy aging with specialised chair-based physical activity interventions in populations with different levels of pre-existing frailty and independence. Uh, frailty is a common and typically significant condition in geriatric populations, the latter predominantly due to its association with adverse health outcomes such as hospitalisation, disability and mortality. Uh, physical activity and exercise interventions have been proposed as potentially offering the best form of treatment for frail geriatric populations. However, to date there is a surprising lack of multidisciplinary research pertaining to this area. Uh, my PhD will um, assess the impact of physical activity interventions on multidimensional health, incorporating not only physiological health but also psychological, cognitive, social and emotional health and functional capacity. Um, concurrently over the course of the next several months we will be conducting two studies, um, one in the uh, Queen Elizabeth Hospital here in Birmingham and the second one in the Ryland View Public Care Home in Tipton. My first study will take place here at the Queen Elizabeth Hospital Birmingham, which is the largest hospital in Europe. Specifically, the study will take place on the Harborn Ward, which is a geriatric ward of the Queen Elizabeth Hospital. Um, here we will implement two chair-based physical activity interventions with frail geriatric populations on the ward. The first will be Move Their Loser, which is an established chair-based physical activity program for older adults, based here in Birmingham in the United Kingdom. The second is a HUR um, resistance training intervention. HUR is a Finnish company specialising in resistance training machines for older adults. The Move Their Loser intervention will predominantly incorporate exercises related to flexibility, aerobic capacity, balance and strength, but predominantly focusing on strength activities. Um, while the HUR intervention will involve a leg extension and leg press machine, the great thing about these machines is that they're pneumatic, so they work based on air resistance. Uh, additionally, they also allow for the weight to be increased in very small increments of approximately 100 grams, which is about the same as a small apple. My second study in the Royal View Group Care Home will also implement a HUR resistance training intervention, specifically in the form of a six-station exercise circuit for frail older adults. Um, this exercise circuit will specifically target the lower limbs, but also to a lesser extent, the upper limbs and core. Both of these studies um, will assess the feasibility of the interventions within these settings as well as within this participant population group um, and allow us also to engage in some degree of limited efficacy testing of our secondary dependent variables related to multidimensional health which will take the form of our primary dependent variables in our proposed future clinical trial. So that's all for me for now, thank you very much for watching and um, I would also encourage you to check out the Panini social media linked in the description of this video um, in addition to the videos of my colleagues who are also conducting some very interesting research in the area of um, healthy ageing relating to physical activity and nutrition. Um, yeah, so again, that's all from me for now. Thank you very much for watching.